huge welcome back to Big Brother 2012, a live eviction number eight. Now, tonight we had eight housemates up for eviction. You've already saved Adam, Ashley, Connor, Dina, Luke A, Sarah. That leaves just Caroline and Luke S. But the question is, who will be leaving the Big Brother house tonight? Voting to save your favourite from eviction is open for the final time. <laughs> from a landline call, 0901 61617, and add the number of the housemate you want to save. Or from a mobile, Call 65058 and add the number of your favourite housemate. To save Caroline, add 05. To save Lucas, add 12. Calls cost no more than 36p from a BT landline and any mobile calls from other landlines may vary. Voting closes in tonight's show, so votes cast after the lines close won't count, but may still be charged. Full terms, you know where to go to. Channel5.com slash bbvote. And we could probably say this all together. If you're watching on Channel 5 Plus One or On Demand, don't vote because you're too late. Thank you. Now, before we reveal who'll be leaving tonight, let's take our final look at yesterday's action. And after Caroline's high-risk, high-sugar joke, housemates experience the crashing sugar low. Eight sixteen p.m. Some of the nominated housemates are thinking about eviction. For however long I stay, let it be tomorrow, the whole way, then no reason for them to talk to me. Yep. Same. And Becky as well. Gave her the benefit of the doubt on Monday. I feel like a dick. I respect you so much for doing that, Luke. You respect me as much as you respect your fucking <clears throat> BMI. Caroline and Connor are admiring her shopping efforts. You know, you've just set, set up this whole thing tonight. <laughs> That's fucking great. You know what I mean? Sorry, but everyone needs to chill out. Yeah. <laughs> no. That's what I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> Everything has happened tonight. <laughs> it's because of what you've done, and it's brilliant. It's but I love, not, I love sitting back and watching it all go mad. It's great. I'm sorry I've caused drama. I didn't mean to. Kaz, it's amazing. <gasps> Well, no, it's not. I don't. I don't. Want to, I didn't want to upset anyone, but are you, you know, I think upset. I, you know. You haven't upset nobody. It's certain people in here that are dicks. Well, you've obviously upset them, but who gives a fine fuck? You don't care about them because they fucking they act assholes around you. So who cares? <laughs> oh my god, sorry. Can we just imagine me going out to Adam and Luke's family and friends tomorrow night? So. Imagine how funny would that be? Cas, why do you keep? Thinking that you're going, I genuinely hope. But sorry, I don't can you think imagine, you but are. Can you just imagine She's it? Not going. Didn't you just think everyone was just like? Oh. No, they better show my reaction on there whenever they see me. I was just like going. I went. <laughs> I was fucking hilarious. Eight forty-five p.m. Adams decided to share the tobacco. Thank you. Thank 
Scott is escaping the evening's antics. Oh, really? Look, Scott, look at how I'm cleaning your batteries. Yes. Oh, God, yeah. <gasps> yeah, no fake tan. Yeah. I just realised. It's really clean. Actually, this has put me off fake tan. Oh. Okay. It, it, I mean, it is the biggest hassle in the world because it comes off all my clothes. It peels. I mean, it's a terrible hassle. I'll just let some water out. <laughs> Scott's having your bath together. Dina is acting as the voice of reason for Adam and Luke Ear. It may seem bad for us in here, in the house, but people are watching this. They're watching everything that's happening. So when we leave, that's when we get the revenge, because they'll leave first. People who are doing things like this, they will leave first. Look at the past evictions. People that have been like this have left, right? And you look like the better person for giving them back. This is put in the business of being rewarded, though. It's like they made the conscious decision to do this. And they'll pay for it at one point. They will pay for it. May not be today, but they will. I know in this house, like, when bad things happen, it seems fucked about the time, but have you noticed everything does fare out in the end? So let them have their day today. It's fine. Twelve or one a.m. Thoughts of eviction have returned to housemates' minds. Oh, this could be our last night. Hopefully not. Mm. Oh shit! I've got... Oh fuck. <laughs> uh oh. Fuck. I got cold sore and you just kissed me on the lips. Well, I mean, I get it. Hmm, probably. Oh, that means I'll get it. Probably. Are you excited about tomorrow? Not really, no. I think in this place, the only place where you can believe in yourself is if you know that you've just been yourself. Right. And you've not done anything <clears throat> to try and fit in. You've not done anything to try and, like, win the game. Do you know what I mean? Right. But with, like, the attitude and the desire to want to stay... Yeah. Is that enough? Like, you don't know if that's enough or not, you know? But if you know that you've got the desire and you want to stay, then you should believe in yourself, right? But it's not up to you, though. You can have all those qualities and yeah. all those beliefs in yeah, that, yeah. but ultimately it's not up to you. Of course, yeah. So, yeah. But then, even if you do go, then you should keep your head held high yeah. and know, knowing that you were yourself. Yeah. There's nothing you could have been else. Yeah. I wouldn't mind being booed if I was just being myself, like, yeah. you know? Not even the booze is I'm concerned about. It's just leaving. That's it. After a day of fun and frolics, Caroline is in the diary room chatting to Big Brother. People are very spoiled. They have no idea what to, how to appreciate blessings. Of course it's a blessing that we have an unlimited amount of chocolate and, and Nutella and biscuits. It's amazing. It's the best thing that's ever happened to the Big Brother house. And anyway, to be honest, I'm leaving tomorrow. <laughs> and, you know, good luck to them. <laughs> I'm going to be the happiest person in the world because I never in my life ever again have to make any form of contact with Luke A or Adam. See you later. Caroline, what makes you so sure that you're going tomorrow? I mean, I find really I find it hilarious that I ordered loads of chocolate because I think that's great. Um, but realistically, the general public will find that really, really awful and, like, so immature and, like, she's obviously just very spoilt and she's just a horrendous human being. I just think that my I don't have as many redeeming features as I do bad characteristics. I mean, realistically, I'm definitely going and realistically, I'm so pleased I accomplished something so great in here. This really was a lifelong dream to spend £550 on my favourite things in the world. I'm really, really happy I went through it then. The voting has now closed. 
Please do not call as your vote won't be counted and you may still be charged. If you're watching us on Channel 5 Plus One or On Demand, put the phone down, you're just too late. So, it's down to Caroline and Luke S. Who have you saved and who, in your opinion, has outstayed their welcome? Find out after this. Welcome back to Big Brother 2012 and live eviction number eight. Tonight, we had eight housemates up for eviction. You've already saved Adam, Ashley, Connor, Dina, Luke A, and Sora. So just Caroline and Lucas remain. It's crunch time. You've made your decision. It's time to talk to the house for the final time this evening. Big Brother House, this is Brian. Please. Caroline. Yes, please get me out. <laughs> Lucas. <laughs> Your time has come. Please, Caroline, please. For the last five days, the great British public have been voting to save. I can now reveal the person with the least votes and who's the eighth to be evicted is... Please leave the big brother house. Right, get really drunk, Caroline. Get really drunk. Caroline, please leave the big brother house. Really drunk, please leave the big brother house. Well spoken, well annoying, and well keen on chocolate. She's going to be talking to us right here. 